China is making significant strides toward constructing its first nuclear-powered aircraft carrier. This development, revealed in a report from the Associated Press on November 11, 2024, comes after an analysis of satellite imagery and Chinese government documents. Researchers from the Middlebury Institute of International Studies discovered that China is working on a land-based prototype nuclear reactor in the mountains near Les Han, Sichuan Province, as part of a classified project known as the Longwei, or Dragon Might, project. China's naval modernization has been rapid, with the People's Liberation Army Navy, or PLAN, already the world's largest in terms of ship numbers. The focus now is on developing a blue-water navy capable of projecting power far beyond China's shores. Nuclear-powered carriers would provide unprecedented operational range and endurance, allowing China to extend its influence across critical maritime regions like the Western Pacific and South China Sea. Satellite images from 2020 to 2023 show extensive construction at a site called Base 909, located 70 miles southwest of Chengdu. The facility is operated by the Nuclear Power Institute of China, a subsidiary of the China National Nuclear Corporation. These developments include water intake infrastructure and housing design for the reactor, which align with naval propulsion needs. Supporting documents, including procurement records, indicate the acquisition of reactor equipment intended for installation on a large surface warship, part of China's Type 004 carrier program. China's existing carriers, the Liaoning, Shandong, and the Type 003 Fujian, are conventionally powered. The Fujian, launched in 2022, introduced advanced electromagnetic launch systems but still falls short in operational range compared to nuclear-powered carriers. The Type 004 carrier would change this, marking a significant leap in China's naval capabilities. The U.S. and its allies are watching closely. A Pentagon report highlights China's naval advancements as a growing challenge to U.S. military dominance in the Indo-Pacific. While China may lag behind the U.S. in terms of carrier numbers and operational experience, its rapid shipbuilding pace and investments in cutting-edge technology reveal its long-term ambitions. China's nuclear-powered carrier program represents a strategic leap that could alter the balance of power in the Indo-Pacific region. With its focus on extending its reach beyond the first island chain, China is positioning itself to challenge U.S. naval dominance and assert greater control over disputed maritime regions like Taiwan and the South China Sea. As the plan shifts from a near-seas defense strategy to far-seas operations, the implications for regional and global security are significant. The Longway project is a reminder of just how quickly China's military-industrial complex is evolving and how it's reshaping the future of naval power.